Excuse me, my biggest. Oh. Oh. This one's huge. Tarpon, also known as the Silver King, are some of the most sought after game fish, some of the most powerful, and also some of the most difficult fish to land. I've caught many, many small ones in my lifetime, but today I'm trying to tackle a giant. What's going on guys? It is my last day in Sanibel. I've been here for like four or five days now, and the bite has been terrible. I've been fishing the whole time. It is the new moon. Fish are just not feeding on anything but filters. I've got some really good bait now. And um, I hooked about five or six tarpon last night. I'm waiting for the sun to go down and hopefully they're gonna come to the same spot. I've got a live well full of baits right now. Some live mullet, live filters. We're gonna try and get gigantic tarpon for you guys. I've been fishing for these same tarpon the whole time. I'm waiting for the sun to come down. There's one out there, I think starting to roll in. As soon as the sun goes down, they should be here. I've got a live mullet hanging out the side here because for some reason he wasn't doing too well in the live well. And also, I've got here Ooh. a fully decked out live well. And we've got the light on the GoPro today, so we should be able to see what's going on for the most part. I am out here. And I've got a live bait out there behind the boat and the current is pulling against it, pulling my bait straight and the current is holding it there. Probably just a couple feet under the surface. No way. <laughs> Finally got one of these things. <laughs> Finally got one, and it's like 100 powder. My phone is in the live well. Yo! Just like that, he threw the hook. How, 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 how? It came, it came towards the boat for like two seconds. I reeled up on my slack and he was just gone. A live pinfish. Filters weren't working that much. I guess it was too common for bait. Now she's just doing circles around the boat. Circles around the boat. Oh my god. This is gonna be my biggest. Oh! Oh my god! It's gonna be my biggest fish ever. Biggest tarpon for sure. I got a 60 pound on now. 
see some 50 earlier breaking off. <laughs> oh my god, I hope I got that jump on video. This fish is massive, guys. This is gonna be probably be a while. But we're out in open water now. Oh, so I'm loosening my drag just a tiny, tiny, tiny bit. Try to put this trolling motor up. I've been trying to get this far this whole time. I can't mess up now. Oh, oh my god. these fights we're open water now shouldn't have any problems let's go baby where is she where is she where is she Ooh. I've lost a fish this size countless times Literally countless times. This is a fish I've been waiting years on to land, and I think I'm finally gonna do it. <laughs> you know, I spent the whole day trying to get bait for these guys. A variety of baits. Pinfish ended up being a ticket. Boat's full of water. Build pump stopped working. I'm getting tired now. I would say this is just the beginning, but I'm pretty sure this fish is almost done. Not as big as I thought she was, but holy crap, it's about a hundred pounder. I've done so many circles around this boat now. <laughs> It'd be cool to get a good jump again. Oh, there it is. This thing is massive, bro. Yeah, I'm finished this yet, buddy. Come on now. Oh, oh he's going under the boat. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, 
thing's like 150 pounds. Probably gonna be here for reviving her for a while. 150 pounder. Doing really good. It's doing really good. It's only been about 30 seconds so far, and she's already turned over, swimming upright. That's a really good sign. I've had it for the day, guys. This thing is massive. lost her you're not ready girl you've got some jaw power still though oh my god just a magnificent absolute beautiful beast Oh! I lost her. She jumped out of my hands, literally. I think that means she was ready. I, I, I don't know what else to say. I was trying to hold on so hard. I, I revived her for like 20 minutes. I, I mean, I think that was definitely enough. She jumped fully out of the water, so. Oh my God. I can't believe that just happened. I am shaking still, guys. That is literally a fish. A single fish. I've been waiting my entire life. I've been waiting my entire life to catch. I've caught plenty of small ones. But there's nothing that compares to something that's literally bigger than you. And I just got her, got it in. I safe revive, revived her for about 20 minutes and she jumped, literally took a jump on the release. I'm pretty sure that's a good sign that she was ready to go. Um, sorry, it's really windy right now. I hope you guys can hear me. Um, that was one of the best days of fishing of my life, without a doubt, without a doubt. One of the craziest days of fishing, so definitely the best day of solo fishing in my life. I've drifted at least a couple, at least like two miles away from the spot, so we're gonna go back to the spot and maybe try to get one more bait out, and then we're gonna call it for the night. For that fish, I was using 30 pound braid, 50 pound leader, and a circle hook, five aught, inline circle hook and that was it <laughs> let me know what you guys think about the release in the comments I mean if they jump out of your hand there's not much you can do I'm bleeding my hands are bleeding just from trying to hold on to him he was shaking his head the whole time and um, I'm soaked the walk the boats full of water the bilge pump stopped working during the fight I don't know what's going on I'm out here in the middle of the bay driving back to the ramp I guess we're gonna, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm done. I, I don't think I can handle another fish like that tonight. <laughs> Seriously worked me. I mean, I am, my, my back hurts so bad now and that drag was so tight. Fighting them for an hour straight like that, constant pressure, it, it'll, it'll kick your ass. I'm, I am <laughs> spent, to say the least, I am dead. Three nights fishing the same exact spot, hooking the same, basically the same exact fish about 20 times until I finally landed this guy. God, it feels so good. Really hope you guys enjoyed the footage, at least what you guys could see what was going on. I know it's, it's dark out here and it's hard to really see exactly what's going on. Anyways guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Stay tuned for the next one.